how are you going to deal with the downtime need for effective BCP planning? And for this, I would like to invite on stage Mr. Yogesh Kumar, who is Head of IT and Business Applications and CISO at Tata Advanced System. Giving a brief introduction for Mr. Yogesh, he carries over 20 plus years of experience with Tata Advanced Systems and many more organizations and carries a strong IT infrastructure management background coupled with experience of setting up information security frameworks from scratch. He has a track record of ensuring effective cyber security and providing meaningful assurance to the board and the clients. With this, please welcome him with a huge round of applause. So, good afternoon all of you. So, um, taking sessions after the lunch, <laughs> It becomes very difficult for any speaker to be there. Uh, anyway, I will keep this uh, non-technology oriented. Technology is very important. Let me take it a little bit squid, skewed from that side. So, uh, we'll discuss about the uh, BCP planning. So, uh, as you are uh, there, uh, we think BCP planning only when it comes to the neck. And uh, during the pandemic time, uh, no, no uh, means not many organizations were having uh, BCP planning in place. Remote uh, working was not there, BCP planning was not there. And uh, many of the organization wake up when there was a call from PM at 8 p.m. <laughs> he declared that now, uh, lockdown is there, no, no more people will come outside. Then suddenly everybody started in those four hours, maximum thing happened. In, <laughs> in our case also we sourced uh, laptops during that period. So as we are into defense, so uh, we didn't have that policy uh, um, implemented at a large scale. But yes, uh, there was uh, some wake up calls us, so uh, we knew that it can happen, so we, we, we were prepared towards that. Anyhow, so uh, so many of the organization are not ready, Let, let's just, so um, we need effective BCP planning. Uh, do you all agree? I think after pandemic, though, at least we should agree that it, effective BCP planning is required. Earlier it was not uh, too much uh, this thing. Uh, only redundancy was considered and redundancy not to the bigger level. So, um, when we come, so we should always think how confident we are towards our BCB planning itself or the disaster recovery plan and how should we plan it. So, there must be a method, there must be a uh, discussion carried out in detail, how should we plan it. So, looking into the uh, IT, non-IT aspects of it. So, um, when we think about uh, BCP, so there may be two types of categories. Obviously, third one is having that one. Companies with no BCP, no DR. And the companies, the more disastrous is that one, second one. Companies have BCP. We have DR. But we do not test it. So, we do not know when actual urgency will come, whether it will work or not, uh, not aware. Okay. Third one is obviously we have DR, we have all things in place, but uh, we have to remember these things. So, uh, where BCP is in place, drills are required frequently. So, if drills are there, properly we have checked, then only we will be confident on to that. Otherwise, uh, there is no point to invest money. Uh, challenges, there will be challenges for every organization. The first one, IT cost is too much. You know, how do we get the budgets? Budgets are very, very <laughs> stringent. Abhi first list, itna bada banta hai. Uske baad mein cut down, cut down, cut down. Then it comes to the urgency level, P1, right? So, IT cost is too much to implement, not enough time or resources to implement. Then the third one is, IT will, it will never happen. 
somebody thinks now after pandemic everybody is awakened but before that it will never happen to our company yeah we have enough uh, resources don't worry on to that side and then why to bother another thought why to bother we have a good amount of data data backup we have hamare paas wo rakha hua hai but never tested we have chunks of data every day we remember to backup the data data backup happening automatically crawlers are there robotics is there everything is is in place but do we bother to uh, check it not many organizations sir even with the bigger organization this happens and once the bcp is declared face difficulty if even entire data center is gone they will face difficulty then we plan next year always we have so we always say tomorrow we'll do it tomorrow or we'll do it next year is budget is year ka budget jo hai wo sort ho gaya next year we will take it up and that next year is next year next year next year every time and uh, too much of difficulty we can't do it so anyway uh, but if we look at the figure then we we will come to know that there is there are much bigger losses to the organization week after off every week uh, the losses go on increasing the organization no bcm solution highest loss so i don't know what kind of business loss will be there every and there is no single golden bullet towards it every organization has its own matrix my organization may have uh, different impact your organization may have different impact so in house bcm solution hybrid we are into hybrid world now so uh, these are the stories uh, you can see so as per gartner what should be the bcm program how do we get, take care of this so every organization must have a bcp strategy but how to take care of that bcp strategy first of all we should uh, check our environment very very important and the business business requirement is very very important theek hai so abhi hota kya industry mein somebody has implemented it oh that that fellow is good so we should implement the same way but we should always check our environment is it fitting to our environment or not that is much more important so if we come to the gartner so this is governance and program management how to take care of it crisis uh, energy management right in terms in case of bcm what should happen business resources business processes so who are all affected so bcp depends on business and how it is affecting business and the stakeholders the stakeholders can be internal stakeholders can be external and extend in case of uh, there is a service which is a public one which is used by public at large like facebook it may impact the all users right or linkedin or anything right so there may be some critical services without which our life cannot run there may be some services which is optional so based on criticality we should always think about the bcp programs so uh, equipment operation we, we can look at it each matrix external stakeholders important for us then customers important for us then the information technology and data it's internal important for us then we have equipment operational technology so equipment operational technology means ot part of it when we are uh, thinking towards the it part of it at the same point of time we should think about the ot part of it every organization some or the other way they are lending lending into ot in power plants definitely ot is a bigger concern so if ot is affected gone entire power plant can shut down and it had happened in the past so we have to be very careful towards that workforce that we have 
other than the IT, non-IT, there are other workforces available in the organization. Vital records we have, either on the hard copy or soft copy, how to take care of those records. If VCP is called up, if let us say entire uh, the facility is got get down, then what should be there? Then uh, supplier and partners, facilities and supplier and partners. Are there. So we have lot of su supplier partners with us. Are, are we taking care of those also at the same point of time? So these are the different matrices that we should take care while planning the VCP perspective. Assessment. How do we assess the risk? So business risks are there. So business risk can be divided into these two. Strategic risk, operative risk, financial risk of the organization and then unexpected risk. The fourth one is also very important, unexpected risk. COVID was one of the unexpected risk at all. Nobody was expecting this. So uh, the moment we keep first three, fourth one becomes uh, equally important for us. So we don't know next wave what, what will happen or next time whether this kind of disaster will happen or something else will happen. We don't know. So we should be prepared to the extent possible. Again, uh, BCP planning, it should not happen erratically. Entire power plant, you cannot have another plant, right? It requires a cost. You cannot have that. So we have to think what should be there optimally. What is the business critical criticality lies? So business planning components, these are few components that you will consider. Business impact analysis, this is very, very important. So when we say business impact, so we have to think if these services will stop, what will happen? Let's say, for example, uh, any organization which is depending on the POS, point of sales, right, softwares. If that software does not work, its entire sale will, will stop. For them, email is not important. That POS is important. So we have to think, for example, uh, for any organization, email can be equally important, right. So there is no single golden bullet towards it. We have to think what is the right fit strategy for our organization. So business impact analysis is fairly important. When we assess, we assess the IT part of it, not the business part of it. So if I talk about uh, IT redundancy versus business redundancy or business risk, so we have to focus on the business impact first. Right? Then uh, program administration, okay, the time is done, <laughs> okay, so let me see, uh, I'll finish it from. Uh, critical business activities we have to check, records of the day-to-day -day operation is important, equipment required to run activities, so that's why these are the generic terms. Knowledgeable staff to run the operations, what are the knowledgeable staff? What happens? Let's say one fire is there. If fire hote hai, fir kya karte hai? Dhoonte jisne fire ka training liya hai, usko dhoonenge. <laughs> fire extinguish karne ke liye. But we should know. The things which can be known by everybody, we should know. That's why knowledgeable staff becomes the concern at time. Abhi BCP ho gaya. Abhi jisko knowledge tha, he's on leave. Now, everybody is stuck up. We must have redundancy, toward, redundancy towards that also. Information about the stakeholders to, with uh, who rely on you, right? Legal obligation, this is also uh, a critical at times. What are the legal obligations if you do not have BCP in place? If your data is lost, what are the legal obligations, right? So impact of disaster and uh, the uh, everyday operations, on everyday operations, right? Then BCP versus IT redundancy I talk about. So 
so what should be there so bcp readiness or it readiness so it another server right but does it impacting business does it impacting only it we have to think out then only we should uh, finalize our strategy so on the case of urgency i'll uh, give an example there was uh, one pa to minister he used to take bribes aur har file mein wo urgent likh kar ke bhej deta tha so every time it is a urgent file so minister he used to sign it urgent urgent one day one really urgent file came now what to do then he has written by god this is urgent so when we say our budgets it budgets we say everything urgent the budget lena hota to urgent hota hai ye bhi urgent hai wo bhi urgent hai then only budget is according but when something really urgent is there we are not there so effective planning for bcp dr we should look into the business objectives which i am talking about again and again rather than it objectives selection of services for bcp that categorization of uh, these services into critical medium high low if we do not have a categorization we will end up into a wrong strategy for the organization so we must have that then major selection criteria is the business impact which is making a business impact more is critical if business impact is less then it is less critical then assessment of the real relevant ito rto that we we have to assess how much time it should be up how much time we can uh, we can afford to lose the data one hour two hour real time what so accordingly the cost will be arrived this all have cost impact right whenever you plan then we have to present it to the board if required otherwise to the top management we have to take it up how to protect and maintain your critical systems remotely so we have nowadays we we know now how to remote how to maintain it this is what about uh, iso 20 uh, 22301 says roles and i will not go into the details of it because i'm losing time here so anyway so you can go through this one so uh, we have a base bcp planning uh, template which we can use to plan our uh, impacts plan our uh, things properly right then next is uh, this bcp drill this is also important for all of us we must have a good bcp drill and that should be repeated after some time right at a equal uh, at regular interval of times then secure remote we will talk uh, we have what discussed so best practices available over the bcp uh, dr in the industry these are few of the basic uh, best practices anyhow these are not the only ones so we can have more okay documentation of the dr policy that is important because when dr happens if somebody doesn't know about it kaise karna hai to gaye sab kuch hone ke baad mein bhi it's not there dr documentation must be there determine your recovery options how to recover out of it communicate clearly communication is the ultimate problem at times we do not communicate awareness is another problem awareness and communication this becomes a really disastrous thing in every organization if we are not aware we do not communicate then we are keeping everything with us we have a good planning we have everything good but we have not communicated even the peer members doesn't know so then communication is important right prepare 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 that is the uh, ultimate strategy so we should always prepare then again prepare why again prepare means we have to change it according to the time the covid time non covid time every time is not the same we have to think which time what strategy we have to take it up right okay <laughs> so real time challenges this 
uh, only one minute I will take. So, awareness, priority, decision making, these are the uh, real life challenges when we decide our VCV planning. So, uh, please look at it properly so that your BCB planning is proper and there is no uh, uh, mishap happens after this uh, BCP planning is into the place, right. Okay. So, uh, we can see this data center tomorrow. Nowadays, there are advancements in the technology, IoT advancement, then virtualization, everything is virtualized nowadays. Data center as a machine concept is coming and uh, the fewer manpower or no manpower will be there into the data center. Just like uh, manless uh, this banking concept is coming. So, similarly data center will be there. Only robots and the machines will be working. Right. Thank you with that. Sorry, I have taken more time. <laughs>